Alrighty. Hello, everyone. In case you're a bit lost, there will be no league matches today. We will be sitting back and enjoying a cup final that I think is one to remember for the ages. Rovers will be hosting Eshtahan. Eshtahan are, are our cup. Uh, what you call them? Our cup uh, champions, I guess. Our cup uh, <laughs> merchants, I guess. But they're very familiar with winning the cup. They also have a league title under their belt. Rovers, however, have never won a title, league or cup. So a win today seals their their name in that. And they can have comfort knowing that they did their best. So to give you a rundown, both Eshtehan and Rovers entered in the quarterfinals of the cup this season. Rovers beating Norfolk and Leyenda to get to the final. And Eshtehan beating Dragosh and the Royals. Now this is not the first time that these two teams have met this season. They actually met last week in a League Cup, or League Cup, the League match. Eshtahan and Rovers faced off for match day 13. Rovers beating Eshtahan 2 1 away. And they also faced each other early on in the season. Let's see. Yeah, in match day 6, Eshtahan won that game 2 0 at home. And if we take a look back in history, Eshtahan won the cup in season four. They lost in the final in season three against Dragos. They won the cup in season two, and they didn't make it in season one, I think. So somehow, Eshtahan have made every single cup final Somehow, this is crazy. Except season one, of course. They lost the they were they lost in the quarterfinals. They were out right away there. All right. Now nah, we need we need dramatic music here. Let's see where's my music. Uh, let's see what's a good dramatic song. Probably. Not ah, this one's pretty dramatic. All right, but that's how we stand at the moment. You guys know the you guys know the drill by now. You guys know how the how the pieces look. So look at that, Eshdot and Rovers are pretty much on the exact same level. It could go either way again today. If Eshdot went today, oh my goodness gracious, it'd actually be ridiculous. And super heartbreaking for the Rovers. But if, heart, if Rovers win today, I think it'll be a shining star for them this season. And in, uh, as a team as a whole throughout their entire VPSA history. So obviously we've switched back to the summer schedule. So it's going to be bright and sunny day. No more overcast, uh, cloudy days. All right, everyone. Are we ready to go? Everybody's here in the chat, get to see it. Everybody's getting ready.
All right. Players are on the pitch. The end of the cup. We're right. This is the penultimate. Well, technically, for the regular season, we still have the playoffs to go for, and some European matches. But we're pretty much at the end now. Don't forget to like the stream. Yeah, like and subscribe. Ring that bell. Notification. All that good stuff. I don't know. I can't imagine saying that. <laughs> That's so funny. Alright. Both Eshtahan and the Rovers have made their changes. They've tested things out. And now... You know, it's only 90 plus whatever other minutes are in store for us today. Oh, good early pass from Eshton. Chris Powell gets up from Owen. Chess. Chess is always a dangerous target. Chess. Oh, he's dribbling about. He's turning. He's twisting. Oh. But yeah, key players for Eshdan, definitely going to be Chess. He needs to be on guard today. He needs to take his chances. He's one of the best strikers in the league. The Eshdan defense will also need to be on top notch. Here's Lund. Oh, He tries to send it into the middle, but the Rovers defense is on it. It's a very fast-paced game. Trey Lumen finds Chris Powell. Good stuff again from the Rovers defense. And as for the Rovers, definitely same thing. Defense needs to be on lock to thwart any chess attempts. Their defense will also have to be really good. What on earth? One like equals one good season for Linda. Yeah, hit that hit that like button. <laughs> Hit that like button, and uh, if we can if we can hit three likes, Leenda will be crowned champions through administrative uh, ta uh, a choice. I turned on the uh, extra time and uh, penalty kicks, right, guys? I could have sworn I did, but for some reason I'm doubting myself. It's the, 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 the momentous occasion. <gasps> Chess! Good save. Ooh! Ah! Oh. Cass got there at the right place at the right time. It could have been 1 0 right there, you know, for Eshtahan. Again, these two teams have canceled each other out. Eshdan winning early in the season. Rovers beating them on the return leg in the league. Oh, excellent stuff from Chess. He's forced his way through the defense. Chess in the world! Good save. Good save from Kask again. You know, Eshdan are really starting on the front foot right now. Rovers really haven't had many chances up front. Tries to pass it into space. Extra time and penalties is turned on. Perfect. Oh, this is a good chance for the Rovers. Garcha's in the box. What? What a goal from Garcha! In off the post. And the Rovers start off with the lead. Basically their first chance that they get up front. And Garcha takes it splendidly. What a cracking goal from Garcha Sebastian. He was 
I don't know what happened there in the defense. He was all by himself. Cuts in and in off the post. <clears throat> Brilliant stuff from Gacha. Well done. But I don't think that that will be the only goal we'll see today. Here's Virginia Emmett. I don't know, was he, was he given a pass from that? I think he was. So there will be an assist on the play. Man, that's got to be so disheartening for Eshdan. They were really on the front foot and they looked to be the team that were going to score first, but Rovers hit them on the counter. They let up a bit in the defense and they've conceded right away. So let's see if they can grab an equalizer. I think they can, but the second goal is vital here. Good stuff from Neinho. Oshalic. Oh, good pass to Shakiri. He was unopposed again. Man, their wingers are just drifting into space. Ashan are letting them through. Like a hot butter through knife. Or <laughs> a hot butter through knife. Yeah. That's what I meant to say. Like a hot butter through knife. Uh. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh. No foul. Ademi sends it in. A hot butter through knife. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know what I meant. <laughs> yeah, quality stuff. Hot butter through knife. Come on, Eshan needs to recollect themselves here. Thumped into space for Jenna Emmett. Oh, he was basically mowed down. Like a hot butter through knife. Yeah, you know, it's actually one of Confucius's uh, least known teachings, actually. And I'm pretty sure Lao Tzu said the same thing as well. You know, some variation of that. So, you know, wise words to live by. Kick fresh on 26 minutes in. They could still find their their way back into this match, but the Rovers defense has been really, really good. Oh, Ademi was offsides there. Yeah, the stuff from the defense. As it stands, the crown, the cup crown of Eshdan is slowly slipping from them. They need to get, they need to get their bearings. They need to fight and win. a nervy ball oh good stuff Trey Lubin yes Trey Goatman he's gonna have to play his heart out today oh oh Lee's through no Lee Lee was twisting and turning oh it's just over the bar
sitting next to him watching it. Trey Gelman. How's it going? Hope you've been well. Oh, good interception from Virginia Emmett. Oh. Thirty-five minutes in. Gotta try again. Good stuff from Nerino. B Rob. Oh. Oh, it's it's pandemonium. Stianovic. Virginia Emmett comes flying in still with Stianovic. Good header away from Trey Lumen. Again, Trey Lumen with the good clearance. That's what Eshdan will need. They can't afford to let a second one in. That would really, really make things hard. Trey Lumen wins the foot race and clears it away. Shalich, good cross. Kabidi's got that one. All day, every day. Eshan have kind of slipped the ball a bit. You know, they were they were really good early on in the match, but the Rovers goal kind of thwarted them out a bit. But here's Adams. Adams. Ah. Kent. That was Kent, right? Yeah, good stuff from Kent. Virginia Emmett. Oh, good pass to Chris Powell. It was offsides. But it was a good good attempt. Oh, he was like a knee offsides. Yeah, it's going to be hard to get past the Rovers defense. They really struggled in the last match in the league. Those of us who were there, we saw that. You know, the defense basically didn't allow them to breathe. And it's kind of happening a bit of the same today. Good stuff from Tyler Adams. Tyler Adams. Oh, he's skipping about. He cuts in. Good cross. Headed away. Almost from Eshdan, they're right on the doorstep. Pashalic with excellent dribbling, they might hit him on the counter. Ademi. Oh, Trey Lubin to the rescue. Yeah, they, again, they can't let a second one in, Eshdan. That would be... That would make it extremely hard for Rovers. It would basically be... It would be right there. But we're going to go to the break. Half of the match has been played. It's in the Rovers' favors at the moment. Ooh. There's so many chances, you know. It looked like Eshan could have get the got the first goal. They were they were, they were going through like a hot butter through knife. <laughs> okay, it was a pass from Stojanovic. But yeah, that was. That Ejon really dropped the ball there. I don't know how they just let him through. But Rovers took it. And they were not going to miss that one. a replay but okay all right oh the music cut out no wait no hold on hold on hold on yeah it cut out right at the right time okay so 45 minutes have already gone by 45 minutes remaining 
if Eshdan don't find their way back into this match, it is only 45 minutes. If they do, we'll have a little bit more time left. So far, Rovers have been hanging on. Eshdan are right there, still in the match, I think. But just they just need that, that magical moment. That magical moment if they want to get back into this. Rovers will have to uh, stay calm, collected. See if they can hit him on the break again, get a second goal, and that would really make things a lot easier for them to see out the rest of the match. But yeah, how's everyone doing? <laughs> how's that first half? This is very exciting. Let's see, I need to queue up the second song to make sure we have the dramatic vibes going. Hmm. Hmm, let's see here. Mm -hmm. Probably that one. That one's good. Okay. And the and the in-stadium music cut out at the exact same time as well. Man, we're just flying today. The music is learning when to stop. Yeah. It's like some AI or something. Man, this game really does work in mysterious ways. Emmett is sad. Oh, good pass to Gacha. Emmett could get sadder. Kabiri, nope, he, he went away at the at the last minute. Oh, Eshjan were kind of sloppy there, but they managed to survive. On the edge of our seat, oh snap. Yeah, there's still there's still plenty of time to play here for Eshjan, so they could get it, but you know, it's still one goal. So everybody's nervy. Oh, free kick for Rovers. Kirs. Good clearance from Virginia Emmett. You like to see that, just clearances right off the bat, no nonsense. Just get it out. Ademi. Ademi. Aww. Poor cross. Oh, Gusta from Nerino. Nerino's been on it today. Nerino and Trey Lumen have both been really good defensively. Here's Chess. Good stuff from Stojanovic. I'll be interested as well to see if any subs will come on. Maybe change things up. Do you have the activity? Yeah. Do you have the activity check-in next week? Yes. Yep. Yeah, I'll let you guys know when when the season ends, when it'll stop. I've also considered doing it like sporadically in the off season. So yeah, don't worry. Be happy. Chris Powell Boom. to Torres. Ah, see, that's what I'm. That's what I've been thinking. They just aren't able to get through. The Rovers are just super, super tightly packed together. Very, very well, well uh, organized, well planted. Shikari Pashalic. Oh, good pass to Kirs. Kirs. Kirs is through. Kirs. Good save. What a save from Kabiri. That one would have been the second one. Trey Lumen giving some instructions. Oh, we'll have some subs here. Kent is off for Maloy and Powell's off for Baninha. Early on in the early on in the second half as well. 57 minutes in. Oh. oh, it's going to be a yellow card for Loon. Oh, yeah, that was pretty reckless. Got a bit nervous there, Loon. Oh, my goodness, what on earth was that? B Rob almost put it into his own net. 
Oh my goodness, that would have, that, my heart sank to my legs. Jeez. Stojanovic. Stojanovic. Good deflection. Punched away by Kabidi. Baninha. Hmm, what will it take? If Ejan do want to find a way back into this match, what will it take? Because they aren't really getting into that final third to get many chances. The Rovers have just been really good. Oh, I might have just jinxed it. Virginia Emmett. Just puts it in! I come on right when I was saying it. This game. Chess puts it in. They're overjoyed, Eshan. They found the way back into this match. What an effort from Virginia Emmett. And Chess as well. Virginia Emmett really fought for that one. And Chess with the really acrobatic finish into the back net. Back of the net. And we have a game on our hands now. Oh boy, dang, this game is not failing to deliver. Oh, good stuff. Pashalic. Oh, they could come back. Good save. Oh. Excellent presence there from Kabiri. He covered himself well. Another sub here. Oh, Ademi's coming off. That's an interesting sub. Kiris. Oh my goodness, he flung himself into that one. Good pass to Chris. Kiris, no! Kiris was all by himself. Oh. Just wide. I need to stop, maybe. I really need to get, maybe I need to go see like a psychic or something. That That is very weird that that happens to me. Nerino. They're being pressured now by the Rovers. Rovers know that they've let it slip. And the more time passes on, the harder it will be to get their lead back. And here's Lee. Lee, good cross. And Chess's header is well over. They're generating their chances, which is important. Man, if this match goes is goes to extra time, I'm not gonna have any more uh what's it called? Any more nails. I'm gonna have to chew them all off. Someone should make a compilation. Yeah! Like a like a curse compilation. The things that I say won't happen then they do. Jojo. Pashalich. Ooh, Tyler Adams. He's challenging that one. If Rovers don't win this, will be their worst season yet, in my opinion, regardless of where they finished or where they got to the final. Uh, I, I don't know. Probably not their worst. They've definitely been playing really well, like, throughout the season. Cicchetti's off for Bassanelli. Bassanelli. Good clearance from Loon. B Rob, Nerino. Oh, they're giving it away. Lee Ji Hoon. Oh, right at Kabiri. 70 minutes. 20 minutes left in regular time. Both teams will need a goal if they want to finish this game in regular time. Yeah, I don't think this will be their worst season. I mean, they definitely have a play style. They have a consistent player base. So, not really. Although, I could probably see it because, you know, you think they push for honors, but that doesn't really matter, I think. He's off for Cook. Neil Cook is on now. The subs are on. That's a thing, too, you know. You can always field your best 11. But if the subs come on, you need to make sure that they're on the same level and they can integrate themselves well into the game. 
Good stuff from Nadinho. Checo Torres. What a pass to Vanina. Aww. They're getting it away too easily there. Tyler Adams with the ball. Tyler Adams. Oh. Tyler Adams almost found a way through and he was almost a bit sloppy there lunging into Kiris like that. Oh, good stuff from Nerino again. Nerino's been having such a good game today. He's just been swooping in like an eagle. A golden eagle perhaps. Oh. Tripped up. It's going to be a long free kick for the Rovers. Oh, Chess has somehow found his way through. Baninha. Baninha. Good cross. Uh, they've left the middle. The midfield pretty much open there, Eshtahan. They should be careful. Rovers could mount a counter through that. And they tend to like that. Stanovic. Man, these players have played their virtual hearts out. <laughs> really, I mean, literally, both of these teams have really played really well today. So I think regardless of the result, they should both be very happy with the way they've performed today. Stojanovic, Skirla, someone was outside there, Jekyll Torres was signaling the offside for Garcha, good stuff from the Eshton defense to draw him off, <gasps> Luna is off for Smoochie, Smoochie's on the pitch, oh snap, he's gonna kiss his opponents to death, that is an interesting thing though, Smoochie is a bit behind the pace, he is a rookie so we'll see how he does, Basanelli, Oh my goodness, what an effort that was from distance from Stojanovic. Kabiri had it though very easily. 84 minutes in. The clock is ticking to get a result in regular time or we might go to extra time. Let's see. What have, what have, our, uh, what have our stats been like for extra time? Unless it doesn't come to that. Here's Cook. Oh. So let's see. In season four, the final was determined through penalties. So that one went to extra time. The third one was one in regular time. The second one as well. And the first one as well. So we've only had one instance where a cup final has gone into extra time. But so far, no matches have been um, decided in extra time. They've all gone to penalties, the only one. Free kick. Oshalic. Kirs now. Tries to find Basanelli. B Rob wins it back. Good clearance. Oh, Basanelli! He was just a bit behind, but he could have been in a great position there. We're in added time now. Stojanovic. Oh, God. Eshjan need to hang on. Rovers. Rovers are moving in. Ah, oh, they are. Skurla really scuffed that one up. He hit it with his, the back of his hair. So for the second time in VPSA history, we'll have to go to extra time in the league, in the cup final. Oh <laughs> God, it's not the league cup final. I'm stuck in the past. All 
Alright. Man, what a game this has been so far. That was the first goal for the for the Rovers. And they were in it. They were looking to hold on till the end. But then Estehan came flying in. Regina Emmett with an absolute massive individual effort. Right into the path of chest. Who will not miss from that distance? Who scored as John's equalizer? You saw right there. Chester Chess off the cross from Virginia Emmett has sent this match into extra time. Oh god. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Golly. So yeah, because the match has gone into extra time now, the subs will have to play an excellent role today for each of their respective teams. But yeah, Rovers were really dominating up front. Ejon hit them on the break. That cross wouldn't have been made if I didn't get subbed off the minute before. Ah, oh, man. Michael Kent will go to bed in the hotel wondering how it could have been different. But we'll see. We've got at least 30 minutes left here in match. It might be one there or we might have to go to dreaded penalties. Which is a lottery at that point. Whoever has the stomach and the heart and the mind to go through will take the trophy home if it does go to that. So how about we roll right into it then? Oop. I'm so jittery, my fingers accidentally pressed the uh, button twice. Alright. We're back underway. 15 minutes in each match, in case you are not aware. <gasps> what a pass to Cook! No, Cook! He hit it with his toe hairs. Ah, oh, he should have done better there. But he hit it with the slightest of touches. He hit it with his big toe. Oh, Basanelli has broken through. Skirla. Oh, oh, it's fought in the middle. Basanelli. Good stuff from Trey Lumen to get into it. It's going to be a corner for the Rovers. Kiris to take it. Kiris whips it in. Headed away by the defense. It's going to be another corner. Oh, my goodness. What an effort from distance, but Kabiri had it covered. Took a good dive. Merino. All the way to be Rob. Gonna be a throw for Eshtahan. Torres. B Rob. Nerino all the way in the middle. They're playing it out back. Ashton. Smoochie. To Cook. He finds B Rob on the wing. He tries to switch it, but doesn't really work out that well. Smoochie wins it nicely. Baninha. Baninha's in. Goes through everyone. Chess is going to pick up the loose ball. Chess. Cuts back. Back to B-Rob. Sends it in. Good header away.
Lee Ji Hoon. That's not Lee Ji Hoon. That's Jojo. My my mind is all fried. I can't think straight anymore. Jojo. Oh, excellent stuff from Jekyll Torres to win it back. Oh. Ah. Ashan let it slip a bit. Basanelli capitalized on it, but he couldn't keep it on target. We're getting ready to approach the end of the first half of extra time. Baninha. Smoochie. This could be good from Smoochie. Adams. Oh, He hit it right at his... um. Right at his knee. Adams to Cook. I believe that took a deflection. Jojo's on it. Gacha's drifting onto the wing. He's open again. Oh, Nerino again. Golly, Nerino. What a player he is. But we've gone to the break. Nothing to say in the first half of extra time. Everybody's just hanging on. I'm wondering if we're just going to see this match out until penalties. Awesome, the music cut out at the right time. So let's see, the, these could be the last 15 minutes of the match. If it's still no goals, if the things are all square, then we'll have to go to penalties. Unfortunately, that's how we have to decide things in football, so. Let's see, will there be any heroics today? Here's Chess. Virginia Emmett. Good stuff from Kirs. Excellent stuff from Kirs. All the way back to Kask. Good stuff from Jekyll Torres. Nerino. We'll play it down the middle, but it was kind of a questionable decision. It finds Skirla. Oh, it hit his ear. Garcha. Cook to Baninha. Just 10 minutes left in this second half of extra time. Ajan could cook something here. Nah, everyone's very leggy now. Smoochy. Back to Baninha. Still with Baninha. Jekyll Torres. Retains possession to Adams. Back to Smoochy. Oh, I took a deflection. Basanelli does well to recover. Basanelli tries to find it into space, but Smoochie's on it. Oh, Basanelli wins it back. It's with Pashalic down the middle for Kirs. Pashalic. Oh. Again, it's, it's kind of like both teams are a bit scared to take a risk, you know, so late into this match. Baninha. Baninha. Baninha finds Cook on the wing. Cook needs to send in a good cross. Headed away. Jekyll Torres to Smoochie. Smoochie's cross. And Chess! Oh! Smoochie's brilliant cross in. Chess had that one. Oh, it almost grazed the post. What could have been? Mourinho does well to thwart Garcha's attempts there. It's going to be a throw for the Rovers. 
in a very interesting position. Here's Kirs. Good stuff from Virginia Emmett. Kirs. Pashalic. Virginia Emmett back to Kabidi, who's going to clear it. Nerino. Kabidi. Plays it short to Lumen. Out wide to Smoochie. Back to Lumen. Stop playing out back! You guys are going to make me my fart out of lung. Jesus Christ. B Rob. Oh, good stuff from B Rob. Checo Torres. Oh, they've intercepted it. Skurla plays it to Basanelli. Smoochie. Oh. Back to Pashalic. Oh, good stuff from Neil Cook. And I think this match will go to penalties. It's going to go to penalties. Oh, boy. Trey Lumen's just posing for the camera there for some reason. I need to record this so I can write down the penalties. All right. I, I'm not going to play any music. We're just going to have to sit with the silence. But yep, this match has gone all the way to penalties. A reminder that they go by extremely fast. So don't take any breaks. So just as a just as a preamble, we're gonna go to penalties here. Rovers took the lead first, then Ejon found their way back. Extra time was a uh, nervy, uh, nervous, uh, just nobody wanted to take any risk, which is I mean expected in extra time. And so we'll have to determine this match on penalties. So without further ado. Here we go. Remember, they go by fast. Don't blink, you might miss it. All right, who's up first? Skirla's up first, Skirla against Kabidi. Skirla with the first penalty on the left. Really well done by Skirla. Chess, who scored today's goal, found Edge on the way back into this match. In the same place that Skirla hits it. Really good stuff from Chess. Here's Garcha. Garcha's always a good striker. Oh! Garcha has sent it over. Oh my goodness. Ejan to take the advantage here. Baninha. Oh! Right into the roof of the net. No goalkeeper was saving that one. Basanelli. Basanelli down the left. Really good stuff from Basanelli. Virginia Emmett. Captain Virginia. He steps up to the plate. Cask dove the right way, but he hits the roof of the net. Really well done by Virginia Emmett. Here's Kirs. The pressure's on the Rovers. Kirs, well done. Slightly down the right. Here's Neil Cook. He was subbed on. Cook. Oh, down the right, and this is it. Rovers have to score here. It's, it's on Stojanovic. Stojanovic's heart must be in his throat. Stojanovic. Stojanovic into the left. And Eshjan could win the cup here. It's up to Adams. Oh, God, the walk-up. Tyler Adams. Tyler Adams could be the hero today. Tyler Adams. Tyler Adams has missed it. Kaska saved it. We're going to go to sudden death. Pashalic. Pashalic excellently done. Ejdan can't miss. He's shaking Jekyll Torres. Jekyll Torres. He's missed it. Kask has saved it! And the Rovers have won the cup! Their first title! As a club, Jekyll Torres is heartbroken. Trey Lubin goes to soothe his, uh, his pain. Oh boy. 
Woof. Well, that, that went by really fast. <laughs> All right, and Sean, unfortunately, we're right there. They almost did it, but Cask came up big. And Rovers will take home their first title. I don't think they show the penalty kicks on the replay. Which sucks. Just like that, it's over. The cup is over. Rovers win on penalties. That one was, that was probably one of the best penalties. That one went into sudden death. That's never happened. But yes, I'm gonna have to write down these stats. We'll have to talk about men of the match now, so. In the meantime, while I write the stats down, let me know who you think was the best player today. And you remember how I did the penalties last time? Hmm, let's see here. God, I really have to scroll up for this. There it is. Okay, penalty. Okay. Alright, this might take me a while, so bear with me. Man, I'm still shaking. <laughs> what a game that was. penalty that was from Manina. Alright, almost done here.
Oh, hold on, hold on. There we go. I skipped ahead too far. I missed some of the stats. That was just the end of each as well. This song is a banger. All right, who do we think is uh, man of the match? Five, six penalties. So two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve penalty kicks. Holy cannoli, that's whew, that's a lot. Okay, but anyways. Time to see who man of the match will be. Let's see. Cask, people are saying cask. I think we need to keep in mind the whole game. Here are our sub ratings: Molloy 5.5, Skirla 6.5, Modern Sanelli with a six, Maninha with a five, Cook with a 5.5, and Smoochie with a 6.5. Smoochie came in really good. Let's give it to Stojanovic. Hmm. I mean, in my mind, let's see who had really good game today. Lee was good. Jojo was good. Kent was good. Vashali Stojanovic Kirs. Shikeri didn't see much of him. Or Gacha or Demi really. Gacha I think more so. Nerino was super good. I might give it to Nerino actually. Nerino was really good. Lumen was good. B. Rob Lun. Uh, Jerko Torres. Tyler Adams was good. Lee was really good as well. Virginia Emmett. What? what? Made countless incisions from the right side that caught the opposition off guard. And he was given a 4.5. What the heck? This game's weird. Powell with the 5, and then Chess with the 5.5. Yep, his amazing tying goal was not enough to turn the tides of the match. Yep. Vanina with the 5, Cook with the 5.5, and Switch with the 6.5. But yeah, I think... I think I'm going to give it to Nerino. Nerino was so, so, so good today. Lumen was up there as well, but Nerino was just so good. Obrigado. All right, well that that's it. That's the end. That's the end, guys. That's the end of the cup. We'll have to wait tomorrow for the last matches of the season. Um, we've already determined our league cup, um, and uh, why do I keep saying league cup? God, old habits die hard, I guess. But yep, 
no more matches today. That's all I have for you guys today. What a match. Hopefully you guys thought that that was an incredible match. I really, really enjoyed that one. It was so, so much fun. Um, but yeah, if you'd like, tune in tomorrow. Um, we'll be taking a look at the last, last match day of the league season. Like I said, the champions have already been determined. Griffins will take home their accolades. Um, Rovers with this cup victory will qualify for the Champions League next season along with the Griffins. Um, Eshan will represent us in the Europa League. And only those three teams will be in Europe. Um, and we'll have to see, you know, who will go down to, this, to the VCL in terms of direct relegation and then who will go to the playoff. And then we'll see the VCL matches to see who will go up and then who will face the VPL team in the playoff. But that's it for me today. What a match we had today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, catch you guys tomorrow. Take care, guys.